Happy Friday, everybody. This is a pick a card reading for today, January 28th, Friday. You pick a card. It's your main energy, but I do pull them all together. The cards are for all of us. And happy birthday. If you're born January 28th, we will do your reading next. So if you pick card number one, you have the Major Arcana of the Lovers card. So it's an important day for you. Okay. Now, I feel two things here. For some of you, you may be dealing with um, an important job, and it's a contract job or a decision that needs to be made. Um, and I do feel you are dealing with some kind of insecurities or fears. Um, this is firm foundations, and creating stability is important, okay? Okay. Whatever you plant today is like, um, this is planting the roots to sprout for the future. Okay. I feel that too. For others, I feel this has got to do with, of course, it's love, um, and decisions and love is definitely in focus. And it's again, building a firm foundation. Um, uh, for some of you, you may be dealing with, um, well, this is speaking your truth. Okay. Um, being true to yourself and taking the lead is going to be important as well. I do feel that there you could be dealing with a cancer energy. Um, there is good luck here too for you. Abundant energy too, either way. And I feel that a lot of this is going to reap the rewards in the next several months, okay? If you pick card number two, you have the eight of wands. Hmm. I feel the heart is at play today. Maybe you get a heartfelt message. Um, news may be coming through. Uh, messages, pay attention to them either way, okay? Uh, could be thinking of someone from the distance. Uh, for some of you, you do have a yes answer to a question. It's a yes. Um, I do see something to do with um, goals, commitments. Um, love is showing up today. Um, this can be good or bad. It's like the heartache or, um, heartfelt energy. Um, there is something, um, here showing up as well, that there is transformation and end to a situation. So expect an ending as well. If you pick card number three, you have the major arcana of temperance, important day for you. It's a major arcana for some of you. Pay attention to your intuition, divide guidance, because you are dealing with destiny. And when destiny is in play, these are experiences you need to go through. And some of you may be experiencing some delays, and it is in your favor, because there is a reason for it. Patience is important. Creativity is important. Something is still in the works. Can be money, a hobby, or a situation. You may have to separate from someone or something today, too, and be patient. Um, things may be adjusted to create a balance as well. Okay, dealing with destiny. The lovers, eight of wands, and temperance. There's an underlining energy of fears, worries. Um, when we relax and take some time for ourselves, there is a sense of a new beginning and a triumphant success. Some kind of victory. Um, new paths are opening up here too. Something has been a burden either on our hearts for its happiness or it's not. It's kind of back and forth. These are achievements we have to focus on today that we've accomplished from our hard work and building strong, firm foundations. Our patience will be rewarded. A little bit of scattered energy here. And this could be thoughts of someone that you that's on your mind today as well. Uh, manifestation is very, very high and planting the seeds, seeds of your affirmations or your wants or your deeds is going to um, reap the rewards later. There is a lot of daydreaming, a lot of daydreaming or a lot of um, visions of the future here. Uh, new paths are opening up and big changes are coming in. Follow your intuition and also the warnings that come with it too. All right, so that is the reading for today, January 28th, Friday. I hope you have a wonderful Friday. Happy birthday if you're born today, January 28th. This is a very quick and general reading. This is your soul or your theme and your wish card. And your soul or your theme is the Ace of Swords. Wow. 
breaking free, breaking free, breaking free from restrictions, from um, expressing yourself, um, truths being revealed, speaking the truth, moving forward, powerful new beginnings. There is victory from endings and success. An important, powerful message may come through too. Um, for some of you, I do feel you're going to have to make some sacrifice. Okay, and this is like getting out of your comfort zone, making some sacrifices, um, um, leaving um, a situation where you feel bound to behind. Um, this is either bad habits or um, something that's been very heavy in your mind, a desire you've been wanting to do. So it's time to make a sacrifice and to, you have to sacrifice something to get something, okay? But it's going to pay off for you. Okay, and don't be anybody's sacrificial lamb either, because I do feel they could have been manipulative people and you're going to cut them out. So I do feel that energy. I also feel um, there can be a lot of changes going on and during the solar year and the universe is there. So it's things beyond your control. Um, I do feel the universe will come in and change things up and redirect for you. So there'll be new beginnings, truths, a lot of things, but it can cause sleepless nights, restlessness, because there's going to be a lot of like um, changes is what I feel, but it's all going to be for your better good is what I'm feeling here. When it comes to work, career, and school, I do see transformation, okay? Strong new beginnings. Um, watch your emotions. You know, this could be emotional upheavals, ups and downs, because there is going to be a lot of transformation here, okay? But a lot of good news, a lot of good energy too. When it comes to your finances, I do see that the this is a year where if you do any kind of public speaking, online business, you will be successful. If you are a singer, musician, um, I feel singing mostly, or a comedian, or something where you're expressing and speaking a lot, you will be successful and make a lot of money. Okay, there's a lot of good energy here. When it comes to love, if you are single, that is um, whatever your status is there, it's going to end there is a transformation. Um, the light is shining brightly there. So something new is coming into your love life. If you are in a relationship, communication is going to be very important and strengthening the bonds, especially people that you have not spoken to in a while. Um, sitting down and talking deeply is going to bring some truths out and um, in strengthening a bond, okay? Um, in your partnership here, definitely, I do see um, truths and um, sometimes it's like um, speaking truly and connecting. It's like your bond is going to connect stronger. For all relationships, there is a big sudden change from <clears throat> anger to whatever happens, new beginnings will happen, Okay. Um, truth being revealed, finding out who's there. Um, there's big changes. Let that occur. And new beginnings from fallouts. I mean, there's strong new beginnings here, okay? Your wish for your soul here is the king of swords. Okay. I want to say here, you need to build a very firm stance in your affirmations, a firm foundation, Make some adjustments and this will come through. And also divine timing is really showing up. The important numbers for your solar year is 16, 2, 13, 6, 9. Um, I want to say... 14, the, man, I'm seeing 15 again for some reason is big, or did I already say it, 15, uh, 1, 10, 4, 62, and 27. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead and beyond. Everyone else, a wonderful Friday, and bye for now.